The power of mirroring, people tend to like those who mimic their body language and behavior. Try to subtly mirror the posture and gestures of the person you're speaking with to build rapport. The foot in the door technique, start with a small request, then follow up with a larger one. Once someone has already agreed to a smaller request, they're more likely to say yes to a bigger one. The scarcity principle, people are more likely to desire something that's rare or in limited supply. Highlighting the exclusivity of a product or service can make it more desirable. The primacy and recency effect, people are more likely to remember the first and last items in a list. Use this to your advantage when presenting information. The Benjamin Franklin effect, ask someone to do you a favor. They'll be more likely to like you as a result. The anchoring effect, people tend to rely too heavily on the first piece of information they receive. Use this to your advantage by starting negotiations with a high number or price, making subsequent offers seem more reasonable. The Von Ristorff effect, people are more likely to remember things that stand out. Use this to your advantage by making important information visually distinct. The Zagarnik effect, people remember uncompleted tasks more than completed ones. This can be useful in keeping someone's attention or motivation. The framing effect, the way information is presented can influence how people perceive it. Use positive language when presenting information to make it more appealing. The social proof phenomenon, people are more likely to do something if they see others doing it. Use this to your advantage by highlighting how many people have already done what you're asking them to do.